Alhamdulillahirrabbilalamin wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam amma ba'da habita fillah if you want to make improvements in your life in fact <coughs> it's by dhikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala one of the ways to improve your outcomes and improve your stance and posture towards life and the trials and tribulations that befall you is by remembering Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and you never lose. Qala subhanahu wa ta'ala fi kitabi al-kareem fa'adhkuruni adhkurukum wa shkuru li wa la taqfurun Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says and this is from the command in the imperative form then remember me and I will remember you and give thanks to me and do not become do not show ingratitude and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in kitab al-kareem ya ayyuhal ladina amanu athkuru athkuru Allah dhikran kathira Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in kitab al-kareem o you who believe remember Allah with kathra you know with 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 um, immense remembrance <clears throat> and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in kitab al-kareem wa dhakirin Allah kathira wa dhakirat adda Allah lahum maghfiratun wa ajran azima Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says and the male servants who remember Allah often and the female servants Allah has provided for them with maghfira you know immense forgiveness and ajr and reward and reward azim you know and a great immense reward and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Kitab al-Kareem وَذْكُرُوا رَبَّكَ فِي نَفْسَكَ تَضَرَّعًا وَخَفِيفَةً وَدُونَ الْجَهْرِ مِنَ الْقَوْمِ بِالْغَدُوَ وَإِصَالَ وَإِصَالِ وَلَا تُكُونُوا مِنَ الْغَافِلِينَ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says we can have a kareem and remember your Lord to yourselves uh, with humility and khayfa with fear and without doing this outwardly or with a with loud speech you know quiet or with quiet speech in the mornings and the afternoons and do not be of the ghafilin be do not be of those people who are unaware and ignorant and the prophet sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam said مثل الذي يذكر ربه والذي لا يذكر ربه مثل الحي والميت. The Prophet عليه الصلاة والسلام said, "The example of the one who remembers his Lord and the one who does not remember his Lord." is like the living and the dead meaning that the prophet ﷺ made an example that the one whose heart is open to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and remembering him often is the living heart and the one who does not remember Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala doesn't take any time doesn't even make a stafar throughout the day doesn't make any uh, you know, mention of on on his or her tongue of Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, and in his his or her heart is like the one who possesses a dead heart. 
And there are so many ayat and ahadith mentioning the fadl and the importance of dhikr of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And we want to strive to have the living, to have a living heart, not one that is dead and full of sin and ingratitude. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Wa sallallahu wa sallam. Ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.